time to go behind the gram. Instagram is an open book, but what's the real story behind uh, some of these posts? Let's bring the fans a little closer to Tori Kelly. Now, this first one, you're going to have to listen to it. Check these vocals out. Go ahead and play this one. Oh, oh, like, oh, but, but then it cuts short. It goes, oh, 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 the troubled water. <laughs> yeah. oh, and the vocals, that duo, that collab. Tell us about working with uh, Jacob Collier. Any fans? I'm, I'm such a big fan of Jacob. I'm so obsessed with him, his talent. I mean, his talent speaks for itself. He's like, so insanely talented. He does everything. But he's just such a sweet human. Like, we're genuine friends. And when he, he called me up to be on this song, it was so last minute. Like, he literally was like, I'm in town for like one day. Are you free? And I was like, yeah, for like one hour. Like, I have to go do this other thing. And, but I, I can, we could try to do it. And so we literally recorded that in less than an hour. That's, that's in my, uh, yeah, in my home studio. All so. in one hour. Hey, what you doing? Nothing, let's do a song. Sure. It was, I, I blacked out. Like, I don't remember. When he posted that video, I was like, I honestly don't remember doing any of that. But cool. Yeah, it, it was so fun. He's just the best. All right, let's go to the, uh, the next uh, post here. Uh, you're about to go on tour. You posted here about yeah. the, the dates. Yeah, tour, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> any cities in particular you're looking forward to, uh, you know, hitting any mm. songs you're looking forward to, you know, performing live? Of course, aside from I mean, all of yeah, them. Yeah, so yeah, all of them. The, I mean, obviously the new, the new music, I just, I'm so excited to perform live. Because I feel like when I'm on tour, I can, things change and we add things and every, every city will feel different. That's, that's my goal, to just create a unique experience for every city. You get a chance to like sightsee in each city, like go walk around and... Yeah, I try to. I really love like... Those, those like scooter things, you know, <laughs> just kind of, I feel, yeah, it was like get off the tour bus and ride around because you get to, I feel like it's a cool way to see it's a people city. people like, they see your hair kind of flying, I'm like, is that Tori? No, that's not. I'll hide it. That's I'll hide Kelly. it. <laughs> Somehow. <laughs> yeah. All right, in this next uh, post, you let us know about your, the, the album, of course, Tori. Uh, question, why is now the time, of all times, to release a self-titled album? I know you have a story for this one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I, I really feel like, you know, I respect, there's so many artists that, that came before me who have had self-titled albums and they all have seemed to be these really defining moments in their career where it just, you could tell it just feels right for them. Like, oh, this makes sense. Like, this music is just your name. <laughs> and, you know, whether it's like Aaliyah, I remember her self-titled, uh, Beyonce, of course, had her self-titled album, Janet, her self-titled. There's so many amazing uh, artists. And so I, I really felt like this just, there's no better way to say it than it just felt right. I think I'm just stepping into this season of, of confidence and just kind of really fine tuning what my sound is and, and just having fun and experimenting really with, with these, like I said, these different sides of myself. So um, that's why I decided to name it Tori. All caps, period. All caps, <laughs> period. I was like, why not? All right, why let's not? go to another post here. Uh, you, you met Mariah Carey. You sang in front of her, which uh, I don't know if you're fangirling or what was that whole experience no, singing from Mariah Carey? I wasn't like? fangirling at all. What do you mean? <laughs> you know, I was, I was no, who's so, that? Never heard of her. I was so chill. I was like, whatever. No, I was obviously fangirling um, very hard. I was, I was trying to not look at her when I was singing her song. <laughs> and yeah, I, but then I also was like, okay, well, I don't want to not not look at her at all because then she might think I don't care or that I'm being weird. So I, I was, that's what was going through my mind most of the time. I was like, how often do I look at her? Okay, is this, okay, once I'll do it then, okay, cool, and then I'll wait a little bit and then, you know. So that was, that was a lot of what was going through my mind, just the art of, you know, how do you, how do, you do a tribute to someone sitting right there? Um, but yeah, it was, that was a huge honor for them to even like ask me to do that. Did you ever make like uncomfortable eye contact? Like, oh God, too much, just, you know. Probably. <laughs> <laughs> I got that's you, why I was. That's why I was overthinking it. I was like, I don't want to stare too long, you know. But yeah. Man, this is our <laughs> iHeartRadio album release party for Tori Kelly's new self-titled album, Tori, which is out now. Thanks so much for watching. Did you like that video? You can check out more over here and don't forget to subscribe to iHeart right here. And if you're already a longtime fan, make sure you ring the bell down below so you don't miss a single video. See you next time.